Hey guys, it's True Cubing, and in this video, we're going to teach you how to solve the 2x2 two two Rubik's Cube. Now, just like for the 3x3, three three, we're going to need one algorithm to know how to solve the whole cube. And this algorithm is called the elevator, also known as the sexy move. And it goes like this R U R prime U prime. And if you repeat that, that's all you need to solve the Rubik's Cube. So let's go ahead and scramble this cube up. So the first step we want to do in solving the 2x2 two two Rubik's Cube is to make a face. So how we're going to do this is we're going to choose which face we're going to solve any color on. So I'm going to choose the color white. So I'm going to put all these white pieces onto one face and they have to be solved correctly. So what I mean by correctly is that the face does not look like this. So here, as we can see, these colors don't match up along the sides and we need them to match up. So a solid face would look like this. So in our example, we're going to be solving the white face. So how we're going to do this is look for a piece that we want to solve where it belongs. So I'm going to choose this face to put the white pieces on. So next I'm going to look for a corner that belongs on that face. So I'm going to choose this one, for example. Now notice how it has the colors orange and blue on it, which means that they don't belong here or here. If this corner were touching any, were in these positions, they would be touching this and the colors wouldn't be matching and therefore this corner does not belong here or here. So where this corner really belongs is over here, opposite this corner. So what we're gonna do is place the corner above where it needs to go and perform the sexy move over and over again until this corner gets solved. So we're gonna do R U R prime U prime, R U R prime U prime. Remember we're solving this one down here. Prime, R U R prime U prime. And one more time. And now this corner is solved with the white sticker on the bottom. Next, we're gonna choose another corner. So I'm gonna choose this one. And we're gonna place it above where it needs to go and perform that algorithm. And I only needed to do it once and the corner was solved. Finally, we have this last corner, and it belongs down here, obviously. Again, this corner has these two colors, blue and red, which match up with the blue and red on the bottom. So we're gonna perform the algorithm, and now it's solved. You may end up with a special case, which may look like something like this, where you've solved your layer, but you'd find no pieces on the top layer because they're all solved, but it's not correct. So how you can deal with these situations is to unsolve one of those corners by just doing the sexy algorithm once. And now it's on the top layer. Now what you can do is go reinsert this down here with that algorithm, and then go ahead and do this one. The next step in solving the Rubik's Cube is to put the corners in the correct positions. So in this case, you can see these corners are in the correct positions because if we were to twist them, they would be solved. To prove you, there you go. So this is what we're going to try and achieve. Okay, so how we're going to get the corners in the correct positions is by first finding one corner that is correct. So you may need to do a few U moves to find one, but in this case, I've got one right here. And if we were to twist it, again, it would be solved. So this corner is where we want it. Next, what you want to do is perform the sexy move three times on the right. One two, three. Now you're going to rotate to the left and do the sexy move on the left three times. One, two, three. And now what you're going to notice is all your corners are correctly solved. You may also encounter a case where whenever you do a U move, you can never find one correct corner only. So in this case, if we do a U, we can see that this corner is solved and so is this one. And there is no way to bring one corner to the correct position. So how you can deal with these cases is to just do that algorithm um, in any position. So here we can do it on the right three times, rotate, and on the left three times. And now you're going to have the case which we had before. You find a corner, put it in the correct position. So here, this is the only one that's correct. None of the other ones can be. And now you do the algorithm. The final step in solving the 2x2 two two Rubik's Cube is to orient these corners. So the yellow sticker has to be facing the top for all four corners on the last layer. 
So what we're gonna do is flip the cube round and hold any unsolved corner in the bottom right position here. You may have two or four unsolved corners. So what we're gonna do is perform the sexy move two times on the right. Then we're gonna do a D move on the bottom layer to move an unsolved corner into that position. So here I'm gonna move this one to that position. And now we're gonna do the sexy move again twice. Now we have to do it again because this corner is still not solved. And now your bottom layer is solved and you can just align it and you've solved your two by two Rubik's cube. Again, this is another possible case you may get. You may have to perform the sexy move more times than I just did. So here we do it twice. Then we move this corner to the unsolved spot. We do it again twice. We realize it's not solved. We do it again twice. And now we're gonna have the same case as before. So remember, you always have to repeat the sexy move until the bottom right corner is solved. Two, another two. And we'll move this unsolved corner here. Do it twice and you'll solve your Rubik's Cube. We hope you learned something from this tutorial. If you liked it, leave a like down below, subscribe, comment if you have any questions, and we'll see you guys in the next video.